Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Elizabeth. Now in today's video, I'm going to be doing another hair review. What's new? So the product that I'm going to be reviewing is by As I Am and it is a curling jelly. Now this product, if you guys remember the poll, no, if you guys remember the video I did where I asked you what product should I review next, it was between this product and the Curl Jane. No, that's not it. It was between this product and the Jane Carter and this product won. I'll show you the poll results up here, but this product did win. So this is the product you guys want me to review and here I am reviewing it for you. I got you. So let's start with where I bought this product. So I bought this product at Target and it retails for $12.99. Now I've seen this product at Walmart as well and it retails for $12.97. So save your two cents guys. Go to Walmart and save your two cents. But let's see what this product claimed that it does. So this product says it's a coil and curl definer. It has aloe vera, vitamin E and all this good stuff in it. As I am curling jelly formulated with nature's best moisturizer and curl booster locks in precious moisture as you define your coils and curls. It minimizes frizz and maintains curl definition for days. So I'm going to be testing this product out on those two things to see if it does minimize my frizz and if it does maintain my curl definition i hope it does i hope it does so let's see what the direction says so it says apply as i am leaving conditioner liberally throughout clean detangled hair whilst hair is still quite wet smooth curling jelly onto small sections from root to tip i'm not going to be doing any finger coils to my hair i'm just going to apply this to my hair regularly and i just want to see if it does maintain my curl definition that way i don't really finger coil my hair so i'm going to be doing it like this Okay, so it does come with this. I do like that. You know, we all like that. Okay, let's open that up. Oh, it doesn't. It. You would think it would come full to the rim, but it doesn't really come full. It comes not halfway, but it doesn't come all the way full. I don't know. It has like a very sweet scent to it. Um, it's not super strong. It has like a faint smell, but it does smell somewhat sweet. It reminds me of a medicine scent. I can't. I don't know what exactly to describe it as, but it just has a. A sweet scent to it so let's see how this product look it is like a, a curly it is a jelly product so you do see that okay let's see if I go like that you can see that you can see all that so let me just get a good amount like this so you do you see that it has some stickiness to it because it is a jelly so let's see how it glides on the hair so I'm just gonna apply it regularly oh, oh this product it glides in the hair very soft. Oh, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. So this is all that I'm going to apply to my hair right now. Um, my hands um, are not too sticky. It doesn't feel sticky at all. It glided in my hair nice. It feels like you're not really applying anything to your hair because it just glides onto the hair that nicely. I'm going to let my hair air dry and I'll check back with you guys as soon as my hair is air dry and I'll give you guys my first impression. So this is how my hair is currently looking once my hair is air dry. I do feel a slight cast. My hair is not completely crunchy, but you do it. This product does provide a hold to your hair. So I do feel a crunch you would just have to break it up and then it starts to feel soft my hair is looking shiny which i do like that my hair is pretty voluminous it doesn't look super weighed down and my curls are defined these are what i'm noticing now with this product for my first impression that it did leave my hair pretty defined my hair does look shiny and my hair is kind of soft after i broke up the cast so this is all that i have to say about my first impression i'll check back with you guys tomorrow so we can see how my day two hair is looking hey guys so today's gonna be day two of me trying out this hair product so i can give you guys my overall thoughts for today and i'm gonna make this part short into the point because I want to let my hair do all the talking as you guys can see my hair is looking pretty freaking big right now there is some volume to my hair and that's something that I'm like whoa I wasn't expecting all this as you guys can see my bang area is looking a little bit crazy I applied some of the product today and it glided nicely on my hair I didn't apply too much product in my hair today because I wanted to see what the results were from yesterday and it did leave my hair looking voluminous today my hair does feel soft today which I do like because yesterday I noticed that my hair was kind of it had a cast to it my hair had a cast to it yesterday so once I broke it up it was soft yesterday but it's even softer today so I do like that my curls are defined not as defined as I would like it to be especially the inside part of my hair but overall my curls are defined so I do like that my hair is looking voluminous which I wasn't expecting that but I'm like okay well it looked voluminous yesterday but today it looks really voluminous looking really crazy so this is all that I have to say about the hair product today I'll check back with you guys tomorrow so we can see what my hair is looking on day three with me reviewing this product and me trying out this product by itself so I'll see you guys tomorrow for my third and final review so this is how my hair is currently looking for day three. As you guys can see, it's really voluminous, kind of frizzy, and it looks kind of, it looks really big, it looks really different. It just looks, 
really big yeah so let me break down what are the pros and cons of this product that i find so i feel like a pro with this product is that it does leave your hair voluminous so if you guys do like that voluminous looking hair then i think that you guys will like this product i feel like the way that my hair is currently looking and the way that this product is on my hair I see that it's kind of, I feel like it's kind of similar with the Diva Curl uh, B Leave-In. If you guys saw that review, you guys saw that that product did leave my hair looking really voluminous. And I feel like this um, did the same thing. My hair is looking really, really big. So I feel like it, it reminds me of that Diva Curl product. So it's like a cheaper version of that. Just how it reacts to my hair, that's how I'm kind of seeing it. A pro of this product is that it does leave your hair looking voluminous. And on the first day, I mentioned the way that this product smells. It has like a sweet scent and I wasn't really a fan of it. Well, not that I wasn't a fan, but I didn't know how to really describe the scent. I described it as a sweet scent and that really doesn't do anything. Now that I smell it, um, it, it has a sweet scent. It reminds me of kind of like an orange. It smells like vanilla to me. It doesn't really smell bad, especially when you put it on your hair. You don't really notice the scent. It's very lightweight and it's something that doesn't really linger on your hair. So the scent isn't a, a bad thing to me. It's actually a pro because it's not something too overpowering on the hair. It does have a shine to it. I think my hair does look shiny. I think it looked shiny yesterday as well, even on the first day. So all three days, my hair does look kind of shiny. I'm not sure if it really picks up on camera, but in person, my hair does look shiny. So that is another pro of this product. On the first day, it did have a hold. Right now, there's currently no hold on my hair. It's really, really soft. And that's why it does remind me of the Diva Curl B leave-in. It's crazy. This product really reminds me of that. So let me start with some of the cons. I feel like a con would be that since my hair is really, really... Def not defined since my hair is really really voluminous there's really not that much curl definition there is some curl definition around here around here there is some curl definition but overall my hair is looking very undefined it's looking pretty frizzy around here especially my bangs area is looking kind of weird i try to calm it down this morning by applying more product to see if it can reduce any frizziness and it did but at the same time it really didn't do much it didn't really take any of the frizziness away so I wouldn't really rely on this product to take away any of the frizziness. It's not super moisturizing. I like that this product says to use a leave-in conditioner first because if it didn't and this product claims to keep your curls moisturized which I think it does which it says to apply a leave-in conditioner first and I'm glad that it says that because without a leave-in conditioner this product isn't very moisturizing so it's good that once you apply your leave-in conditioner and you apply this product it is going to lock in the moisture because by itself it's not really moisturizing. So one thing I said that I was going to test out to see if it does maintain my curl definition that's one thing I said in the beginning I was going to test it out to see if it does maintain my curl definition and with this product I don't really think it does that my curls are still defined like some sections are defined while other parts are not but it didn't really it did but it didn't some parts are still uh, defined especially since the first day maybe when I applied a lot of the products to some sections but other sections are not really as uh, defined and they didn't really keep a style definition for a long period of time it's like a pro and con because if you do like that voluminous look then um, you wouldn't really mind of the curl definition because the volume really does look good with this hair product but if you really like to keep your hair super super defined then you would have to apply like a more heavier amount to your hair so that you do maintain the curl definition throughout the days that you use it so overall this product isn't bad it just depends on what you're looking for I'm not really a big fan but at the same time I don't really care for like the super super voluminous look I like my curls to be really defined so with this product it doesn't really work out for me but it depends on what you're looking for so yeah this is pretty much all I have to say about this hair product if you guys tried it let me know what you think do you like it do you not like it leave it down in the comments below I would love to know you guys' opinion on this product if you guys found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys